disrupted protests around the bay. I think we need to draw a line. This is just, to be honest, ridiculous. We're just going to keep saying no. We're still here. Why their own careful planning may come back to bite them in court. What's worse than getting hit by a train nearly being impaled in the process? One Bay Area driver just survived both. From KPIX, this is the Late News with Sarah Donchi on CBS News Bay Area. Hello, I'm Sarah Donchi. Depending on where your commute took you this morning, it might have felt like an exceptionally long day, hours longer than normal. After protesters shut down two major Bay Area freeways to draw attention, to the war in Gaza and attention they got. Their closure of the Golden Gate made national headlines. And then this, later this evening, another protest in the South Bay got tense for a few moments. I was outside the Tesla factory in Fremont. Protesters there caravaned as part of a nationwide day of action demanding a ceasefire in Gaza and an end to all U.S. aid to Israel. I see so many people.